This is video 9.2. In it, we will solve a problem about orbital motion. The question. Suppose a large asteroid is in a circular orbit around Earth at a distance of two Earth radii from the center of the Earth. We'd like to know how fast must the asteroid be traveling in order to stay in orbit? Step one is to find the acceleration due to gravity. We can set this equal to the centripetal acceleration and then solve for the velocity. First, the known constants, the mass, the radius, and the gravitational constant. The formula for the acceleration due to gravity at a distance r from a gravitating object is gm over r squared. And r here is 2 times the radius of the Earth because it was specified that the asteroid is located 2 Earth radii from the center of the Earth. So we plug in the constants g, m, and 2 times the radius of the Earth squared and we get an acceleration of 2.43 meters per second squared. Step two is to find the velocity. We have the equation for the centripetal acceleration, which has to be equal to the acceleration due to gravity, which is in the opposite direction, in order for the asteroid to stay in a stable orb orbit. And this is equal to 2.43 meters per second squared as was just found on the previous slide. And therefore, if after multiplying both sides by r, which is 2 times the radius of the Earth, we get that v squared is equal to 3.1 times 10 to the 7. Therefore, after taking the square root, we find that the asteroid has to have a velocity of 5,570 meters per second in order to stay in orbit around the Earth. And that concludes video 9.2. Check out PhysicsX on the app stores. This revolutionary physics app for smartphones and tablets contains over 100 videos and 500 multiple choice questions designed by education experts. It's been proven to improve scores for intro college physics, AP physics, MCAT physics, and more. Just look for the blue icon.